Hey, hi, hello, hello. It has been a long, long time, but we are back. Sort of. Obviously, this is not my original channel. The process for getting that one back is still underway. I have every reason to think eventually it will be restored and returned to me, but uh, it could take quite a while. There's some manual review that has to happen. Blah, blah, blah. We can maybe talk about more more of that stuff at the end. Uh, in the meantime, I'm going to just be uploading some videos on this channel, <clears throat> things that I just really want to get to like as soon as possible, such as this. Quick tour through the next season of anime, trying to figure out what I'm going to watch. Uh, the last season was really weird. Uh, most of the shows I was watching did not air to completion, but uh, because of COVID, I uh, had to kind of cancel themselves early, get postponed indefinitely. I don't know if we're going to end up seeing some of these shows resurface and finish. I sure hope so. I was really enjoying a lot of them. <clears throat> but uh, inevitably, uh, relentlessly, undeniably, indefeatably, another season of anime is still approaching. Uh, I completely forgot <laughs> that this would even happen. My, my normal seasonal anime treadmill has been so disrupted. Uh, but it churns onwards, and uh, like fish swimming along the current, we have no choice but to submerge ourselves into the rush of the next season. Okay, I'm gonna... Alright, Sweden's already zoomed in. We're sorting by popularity. That works for me. <clears throat> As we've done many times in the past, we're just going to look through all the shows, talk about which ones seem interesting, talk about which ones I'm gonna watch. And of course, I am soliciting any sort of feedback and comments. I have no idea who's going to be watching this video because my channel's gone and I'm just advertising it in the Discord. But if you are watching, please let me know. What, what shows uh, should I check out? Uh, we got new ReZero series. I don't know. I never cared about ReZero. I don't like Isekai stuff generally. And the, the legendary character design of Rem did nothing for me. I, I don't know. I just didn't completely lose it for Rem the way that 80% of the population of the world seem to have. Uh, so uh, I just never watched it. I never cared about watching it. I'm not going to watch this. Uh, this series, I watched most of the first season, and it seemed fine. I liked that the MC was kind of a even more cynical than your now kind of bog-standard cynical harem MC that uh, he, he seemed like genuinely depressed, <laughs> that he had a, a very bleak worldview, and I, and I was kind of interested in how that would reconcile with your, your more standard uh, romantic comedy escapades and stuff, but I don't know, it didn't like entrap me, uh, I wasn't really sold on any of the characters, and uh, I just kind of let it go, and now there's like five seasons, there's like a million seasons. Maybe there's only two seasons or three seasons, <laughs> but there's, it seems like it's just been going and going. Um, and I appreciate that, that even after, like, I think it's been maybe a couple of years since the previous season, they're still going to come back at it. For the fans, for the culture, not for me. This is, uh, what, Fire... Fighters? Fire... Oh, Fire Force? This is a Shonen series. I've heard some good things about it. I've heard this uh, anime is really well done, too. Like, just nice kinetic action, good fire scenes, presumably. Uh, I think this show got put on a hiatus after the, the really tragic KyoAni fire, uh, the, the arsonist uh, that uh, attacked Kyoto Animation Studios. Uh, out of sensitivity, I think they delayed uh, the first season. So this is now the second season, though, so I guess it's okay now. Okay. I don't know. It's a shonen series. I I'd rather read the manga, probably. Hmm. Okay. Another Sword Out Online thing. I don't know what this means. It's fine. The God of High School. Interesting. Studio Mappa is a, a good, good sign. They, they generally do quite good work, especially with these kind of stylish action shows, I'd say. Um, so that's, that's a plus. Hmm. This seems fun. Uh, just straight up tournament arc. What do you want? A whole time is tournament arc. <laughs> uh, I love it. Uh, it's interesting that it's set in Korea, but it's like, oh, it's a line webtoon. Interesting. So originally this was from Korea. Yeah, it's a manhwa. And yet Studio Mappa is adapting it. So far, most of the manhwa adaptations have been uh, like Crunchyroll Originals or like other non-Japanese studios. 
Hmm. No chapters uploaded. Interesting. I don't know if that's because of uh, copyright things. Official English translation since 2014. I see. Um, I don't know. Again, I'd probably just rather read the, the comic. Whoa, what is this? Oh, this is rental girlfriend thing. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I don't know. I, I've heard, like, a lot about this series. I think the manga is quite well respected. Oops. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna guess it has, like, an 8.5. I thought people liked this. Why did I think people liked this? Is it popular? Yeah, it's pretty popular. Okay, maybe that's what I was thinking. I just got it mixed up. Did, did I see it in this section, or did I see it in this section? <laughs> um, uh, yeah, I don't know. This is probably going to be pretty trash. <laughs> uh, not that, you know, just because it's trash doesn't mean it's garbage, if you know what I mean. This is a sensible thing to say in the world of anime. Um, yeah, eh. The premise sounded, like, really stupid to me, but I thought maybe it would be one of those things where, like, from a stupid premise emerges something shockingly heartfelt, like, uh, Molester Man, <laughs> for example, or, uh, by the same artist, uh, Onani Master Kurosawa, or something like that. Uh, instead it looks like a, a stupid series has emerged from a stupid premise. Okay, so we're what? We're zero for four, zero for five, wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, we're zero for six so far. Is the anime over? Oh my gosh, there's no way I'm going to watch this. No, no, this looks not for me. Look how many words are in the title, that's, that's not a good sign. Ooh, Deca Dets. Uh... Studio Nut? Hmm. I think I heard something good about this. I think a friend of mine said uh, it was really, it looked really expressive. I'm so paranoid about watching the trailer. I don't need this new account to start getting copyright strikes too. <laughs> uh, hold on. We're going to do a little investigating to see if this is the show my friend was talking about. Because basically I remember my friend showed me some screen caps from a show that was coming out. And was like, this looks good. Like, look at how expressive this is. And uh, yeah, yeah, it is this one. But based on the screenshots, I was like, oh, this is maybe, you know, like a comedy or something. This doesn't look like a comedy. This looks like... I have to learn a bunch of stuff about, like, a world that's not even the real world. I don't know. I'll watch it. The Studio Nut seems solid enough. Okay. Yeah, this, I don't know. Sounds fun. All right. We got one. We got one. We finally got one. Oh, baby, we got two. Oh, my God. I didn't know this was getting an anime. Oh, man. So I read this manga. It's, it's what it is. It's sweet. It's nice. It's silly. It's very fan y It has both fan service for people who like boys and fan service for people who like girls. So that's, that's cool. Um, yeah, I don't know. It's, it's fine. Uh, I'm gonna guess this is like really low budget because I can't really see how budget would even be spent. It's, it's kind of hard to imagine this being really all that interesting as a, an anime period, outside of, you know, the, the fan service elements, which I'm sure will be abundant. Um, I don't know. I'll try it, I guess, if there doesn't seem like much else is going on. Hmm. You know what I like about this series, though? They're in, in college. They're university age, not just high school age. That's kind of neat. You know, it's a change of pace. It enables them to have, like, different type of uh, plots and, and plot elements and stuff. It's nice. They, like, drink beer together. That's comfy. Okay, what else we got? Light novel adaptation. Here in the town of Fake Word, where humans and monsters coexist, the doctor is... Oh, okay. 
All right. No, thanks. This looks like magical girls, maybe. Oh. What is going on with this season? What, why does everything have to be like this? This one is obviously fetishy, and this one is, like, worse? <laughs> At least here, they have the decency to just make a big boob girl, then she does normal things. She doesn't have to get rented, or reincarnated, or harvested for their H energy. No Guns Life. I've heard this is good. And, you know, Studio Madhouse usually does a very good job. But, mm, it's just not really my aesthetic. Not really what I'm into. So, probably not. Yeah, no. I'm seeing a whole lot of sword and dragon and club and stuff. Never even heard of this studio. L.A. Anch Fox? What? Is there another? Produced by Crunchyroll. Huh. Interesting. Well, this could be the last time I ever think about it. <laughs> uh, uh, is this like an established series? It kind of looks like it. I guess it's just this is the first anime. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Eh. No, I don't think so. <sighs> no. Uh, uh, I mean, I don't know. I've been watching a bunch of K-drama recently, and it's not that dissimilar. It's always, like, super remarkable boys popping out of the woodwork to help a, a plucky, trying her hardest girl. That's fun. But, like, come on. Oh, come on. No. No, I don't think so. Uh, sequel to something I've never heard of. Fine. That, and that's it. And that is it. Wow. Wow. This is going to be a much shorter video than, uh, than all the other ones we've done in this series. Yeah, anime is going through a rough time right now, which uh, is only fair because the rest of the world is too. But it, it really reveals like a quality of reality within anime that I think we often go a long time overlooking. Anime to me is, is often about escapism, it's about uh, kind of taking refuge in a subculture uh, that exists kind of underneath the real world, uh, where, where all of your normal signifiers of social capital and status are, are flipped on their heads, you know? And, and it seems like nothing that affects the real world affects anime and vice versa, that the, the drama and the, the squabbles over best girl and best show and stuff in anime are so inconsequential. Uh, it, it's, it's like a little bubble to just plunge your head into and, and look at cute girls doing cute things. But now, now anime has to reckon with uh, an unprecedented global crisis. And uh, it's, it's not at all surprising in retrospect that uh, things would be pretty severely impacted. Like, how many shows do we have? Can I count? Yeah, these are ranked. So there's 16 shows coming out this season. If we go back in time a little, Spring, which got truncated but started as like a normal season, has uh, a whopping... So these don't even have rankings. What? It stops at 30, I guess. At least 30. Over double the amount that uh, the, the next season is going to have. So, yeah, it's uh, significant. It's not just, uh, jeez, how about the season before that? Uh, 2020 winter. So like 30 is here, and then it just keeps going and going. I guess these are shorts, but there's a lot. There's a lot, is my point, there's a lot. Um. Yeah, so I guess it's going to be more of like a backlog type season. Maybe a K-drama type season. We'll just watch a bunch of K-dramas. Check this one out. Oh, man. Oh, I was looking up. Trying to see where they bought their clothes. This show. Ooh, ooh baby, this show. Oh, fantastic. I just love it. It's on Netflix. All you normies out there, watch Netflix. Look at these ratings. Ooh. 
Oh, baby. Oh, it's so good. Everybody watch it. Just check it out. It's better than all this trash. <laughs> okay, what are we actually going to watch? Let's make our little list here. Uh, yeah, it's uh, slim pickings. But at least we got, you know, a bit of pickings. This is the one I'm most excited about, I guess. Decadence. Just because uh, the, the screen caps that my friend showed me had good expressions. That's all we're working with here. Mizaki-chan. Might as well. Was there literally nothing else? My gosh. Oh, let's look at the shorts, I guess. I, I forgot about those. Peter Grill is the world's strongest fighter. Uh, uh, okay. Uh, uh. Oh, I remember being so excited for Uma Musume when it was first announced. Like when there was just the kind of promo video. But being really disappointed with the show. I don't know. Maybe I should give it more of a chance. What is this? Oh, well, that sounds like fun. It's, uh, I guess there's been a few of these before. This was just an ONA, I see. Now they've made it onto the TV. But yeah, this could be fun. It's just an original? There's no uh, uh, manga or anything? Alright, alright, we'll put it on the list. We'll see what's going on with this. Episode 1 already out. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Huh? What? Wait, what? This was airing last season, and I just had no idea. This looks really fun. It reminds me of, um, friggin', um... Uh, maybe it'll be listed here. Yeah, Seco Boys! <laughs> um, what the heck? This is a two-core series? <laughs> what the heck? How did I miss this? What? This was on the chart for spring, and... I just like never. What? How? Looks crazy. Uh, this I think is already. No, no, I guess not. There's like a special or something that's out. I saw on Netflix. I'm a this looks cool. Whoa, this does look cool. When does this come out? Hmm. Hmm. Alright, enemy's not dead. Enemy will never die. Look, they're doing a whole bunch of, like, ONAs and stuff, too. I guess because, uh, maybe doing TV stuff is, like, a little more difficult logistically with COVID, but just releasing ONAs may be more feasible. This looks cool. Kind of, like, Lupin vibes, maybe. Studio Wit. Studio Wit doing anything that's not, like, super dark and edgy, I'm, I'm quite interested in. This looks, like, fun. And it's, like, already started? Oh, it all came out. Whoa. Okay. Maybe. Maybe. Actually, probably. <laughs> like, what am I? What else am I gonna watch? <laughs> and I gotta finish watching DNA. The rest of the episodes of that came out. I watched like the first six a while ago. Uh. Yeah. All right. I don't know. I'm a little, a little more optimistic now. We got some neat. O and A's and shorts and whatever. Dare we look at fall 2020? Is that spoilers? Will it just make us sad there's like two shows there or something? Eh, let's check it out. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Oh. Oh, okay. Well. Well. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Hmm. All right. I guess we'll uh, we'll get there when we get there. Oh, I've actually read random chapters of this just because it's so silly. That is fine. Ah. All right. Well, whatever. We'll get to it when we get to it. Um, yeah. Let me know. Am I overlooking something? I feel more confident in than I have in any other season that I. I'm kind of not. <laughs> 
These shows are all very much just like what they are. There's no way that this is like secretly a masterpiece or something, right? Right? I don't know. Tell me. Um, yeah, uh, please expect occasional uploads on this channel. I don't know if I'm going to get back into like an actual video making routine because, uh, you know, once we get the, the regular account back, I'm probably going to transfer all of this uh, content over there too, like, as well. Um, but yeah, uh, like I want to do the, the reviews video for the previous season, truncated as it was, and I'm considering doing a gigantic manga reading marathon video, maybe like a live stream or something. Not sure exactly how that will work out, but like, look at this. None of these have been read. Oh, what's this? None of these have been read. How about this page? Surely... Oh, no, just kidding. Stuff has been ending, and I haven't been reading. Oh, snap, that one ended? Oh, man. Look at this. None of this has been read. So maybe together, all together, we'll just do... We'll just read everything, and it'll be like eight hours long. That could be hype. <clears throat> I don't know. Let me know what you think. Glad to be making videos again. I really missed it. It's so much fun. Hopefully, uh, we'll get our account back soon, too. Here, finally. We, gotta, we read some chapters two months ago. Yeesh. Okay. Goodbye.